Hi, I'm Ashley Dalian, and I'm a Pilates instructor in New York City. Today I'm gonna to share with you three of my favorite, most challenging Pilates exercises using the yoga box. If you don't have any yoga blocks at home, just find some thick books, they work just as well. Place your blocks on your mat, about the width of your shoulders, your hands come under your blocks, your knees are below your hips. Make sure your hands are hooked over the front edge so that your fingertips can press into the front of the block. That'll help protect your wrist. In this position, take one of your blocks, slide it directly back, place one of your knees on the blocks. Now, one hand is hovering, so it's on the same plane as your other hand. It's just on an invisible block. And then the back knee does the same thing. So the back knee is up, the hand is up, they're not resting on anything, but they're on the same plane as the hand and knee that are on the blocks. Extend the arm forward, reach the leg back and hold. This is a bird dog position. The abdominals are drawing in and up and the hips are square to the mat. Slowly replace your hand and knee to the invisible blocks. Three more times. Inhale, extend, pause, find a moment of stillness. Exhale, slowly bend in without letting the spine or pelvis move. Two more, inhale, reach out. Exhale, bend in. One more time, reach out and hold. Stay here, three, abs drawing in and up. Two, make your leg long, the arm reaching forward. One, slowly replace to your start position. Take your hand down to the mat, switch sides. Slide your block forward. Other block moves back. Return to all fours. Hand comes onto the invisible block, knees up on the invisible block. No feet are touching the mat. Slowly extend the leg back, reach the arm forward. Hold for a moment. Abdominals are drawing in and up, and both hip points are facing straight down to the floor. And then return to the invisible blocks so that the hands are on the same plane and the knees are on the same plane. Repeat three more times. Inhale, reach the arm and leg away from the torso as the abs draw in and up, and then slowly bend. Take your time. Keep going, two more. Inhale, reach, pause. Try to be totally still for a moment, the abs deepening. Slowly bring it back in. Last time, extend out. Hold for three counts. Try to make your leg long, the spine long, the abs scooping in and up, slowly return to your start position, take your hand down, take your knee down. Next position, blocks are coming behind you. Blocks, again, are about shoulder width. This time, your hands are on the blocks behind you, your knees are bent, your feet are flat. Your fingertips, again, are hooked off the front, they are pressing into the front of the block. Hips are high, look forward, chest is open, Abs drawing in and up. Bring your hips up higher to inhale. And then exhale, look into the chest and round your spine. Straighten your legs and hold. Try to push your blocks into the floor and get your spine up taller. Roll the hips forward, look forward. Inhale, chest is open. You're looking straight past your thighs. Then exhale, look inward. Round your spine, bring your hips past your hands. In this position, try to bring your hips up. Abs draw in, two more. Inhale, roll the hips up high. Exhale, roll the hips back. Try to push your blocks away. Abs draw in and up, one more time. Inhale, the hips are up, chest is open. Exhale, roll the hips back. Spine is rounded, hold. Abs drawn deeper, try to push yourself up taller. Swing your hips forward, bring your hips down. Turn around, face your blocks. Last exercise. Hook your hands off the front edge of the blocks. Extend your legs back into a plank. Hold this position. Abs drawing in and up, spine is long. Keep your spine still, bend one knee into your chest. Keep your knee bent. Lower the shin all the way down and look forward. So now our chest is open. The back foot hasn't changed, but the back leg is straight. Inhale like this. Exhale, look down, round your spine. Pick your shin up. Nose to the knee. Two more times. Bring your shin all the way down and look forward. Inhale, the chest is open. Exhale, look down and in. <sighs> Round the spine, nose to the knee. Abs drawing in, one more time. Inhale, look forward, the chest is open. 
Exhale, look in, round the spine, send your leg back, you're in a plank. Hold the plank for a moment, then bend your other knee in, nothing moves. And then once you're still for a second, lower your shin all the way down, look forward. Inhale, the back leg is straight, the chest is open. Exhale, look down, round your spine, pick your shin up, nose to the knee. Two more times. Shin goes all the way down, you look forward. Inhale, open the chest. Exhale, look down, round your upper back. Abs draw in and up one more time. Inhale, looking forward, open the chest. Exhale, look down, abs draw in and up, round the spine. Find a plank, hold for a moment, abs drawing in and up. And then you bend your knees and you lower all the way down. And that's it. I hope you enjoyed that quick, challenging workout. For more Pilates exercises and tips, make sure to subscribe.